Hey guys, and welcome back. When we last left off, we finally got to the Mount Kazai, I believe it was called. New dungeon awaits. Let's explore. Oh, the music. Listen to that music. Just feel like I'm getting punched in the face with nostalgia. And I like it. Right, let's go. So we have a rope ahead of us. Uh, I don't actually think this is a huge dungeon. Let's have a little slide down. I might be wrong. My memory of this place is uh, <laughs> like, I don't know, 18 odd years old or something. All right, let's go. Oh, right, water straight away. Oh my God, I remember this. Oh, kind of anyway. This is so cool. There's a lot to this game, man. There's so much to this game. Okay. Well, quiet so far. Ooh, Vos is das. What is this rock? Looks like some sort of switch. Uh, ah, yeah, I think that floods the place. Question mark? Yeah, cool. It looks like it triggered some sort of water release valve. Yes. Yes, it did. Kind of. Ah, I see. The switch probably here to fill this area of water. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. Uh, yeah, so there's only two treasure chests here, apparently, according to my notes. Um, and the first one... Okay, it's actually quite far away, I think. Kind of. Maybe. Anyway, I'm sure we'll find them. Let's explore. I'm not sure if we can come back here. I think we can. So, ah, hello. Well, let's go for some Cutlass Fury. Kill these gloopers. We need to kill these gloopers anyway because uh, we need money. Because we've spent, like, all of our money. Which was kind of unfortunate, really. But hey, we got some pretty powerful upgrades. So, I guess it's worth it. And we can actually see all of our new weapons here too, which is cool. Well, that's a kick in the knickers. Ah, I like Enrique's weapon. That's cool. Yeah, this is this is not going well. This definitely could be going better, and he's buffing all of. Ooh, that was nasty. That was really nasty. Alright, well, let's go for a rain of swords. See if we can get this off. Yeah, you better run. Ah, you... Okay, everybody's running away. Well, fine. Didn't want to fight you guys anyway. Sod the lot of ya. That was actually pretty, pretty bad. Okay, so what have we got going on here? Ah. Water. So we've got some more glooper things. That's fine. Let's see if we can actually, uh, you know, Cutlass Fury at least one of them. Yes, we can. Wow, 1,016 damage. Not too shabby. Definitely happy with that. That's a better outcome. Nearly made a grand much better outcome so it looks like we've got a couple of options here I guess that is gonna raise up I don't know why we can't walk over it seems a bit strange but sure whatever 
Yeah, it looks like this place is going to be full of these uh, guys, doesn't it? That's rather unfortunate. Still, if we can kill a few of them. Hey, nice. <laughs> nice, not bad. It's certainly a fairly good way of building our money reserves back up. That'll do, donkey. Oh, nice. Nearly two grand. Definitely worth it. Hey, we got Slipra. Now, what does that actually do, Slipra? Is that the one that will buff all of us? Ah, no. Has a chance to put all enemies... Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so that doubles the speed. Yeah, okay. So it might be worth using at some point, but... We'll see. Anyway. Let's hit this switch and see what happens. Water. Oh my. Oh my. That's a lot of water. Well, it appears that this switch was here to fill this area of water. Yeah, it seems to be a thing. The shame it has to do that fade to black thing every time. But it is what it is, I suppose. There's no secret little area under there. Well, I guess not. Okay. I like the way we literally just have like a beer barrel of air on our back. <laughs> That's actually quite funny. I thought our shoes were glowing then, but it's just the way the shadow is. I do you like this this um, underwater suit? It's kind of interesting. Okay, so, what's around here? There's nothing hidden, is there? No moonfish, for instance? Doesn't look like it. Not yet, anyway. I think there's only one moonfish around. So that is also going to flood. The down below, the main room. Okay, cool. Let's head back. Nice and easy. So, we've done down there. Let's go down south, I think. Oh, cool. Alright. Well, if we're just against these things, let's go for the Lambada Burst. Let's see what this does. Uh, kills pretty much everything. Nice. That was fun. Well done, Ika. Well done. Not a humongous amount of money, but it was an easy victory. Nice. Learning some more magic, which is always good. Um, is it worth going down under here? Oh. Moonfish. I don't remember where the moonfish is. Is it down below? No. It's further over this way. Nope. Oh, hello. Whilst we're in this glorious combat, I can check my notes. Hey, nice. No blooper things, so we can go for... You know it. What we always go for. Right, let's have a little look. So, we don't want to find the charm. Right, okay. So, it is in the middle pit. But we can't get it just yet. Ah, not quite the flawless victory we were hoping for. But the rest of the rounds should... Kill most of the enemies. Nice. Again, not a huge amount of money, but enough. And uh, looks like Vase is pretty much going to level up soon. So apparently there's a cave under here. Which we can go to. And that's where the moonfish is. Cool. Oh. Ooh. Ah. There is a chest. 
We want that chest. I'm guessing. Ah, look, there we go. There's a way in there. And the only th oh, hello. The only thing I hate about fast forwarding the combat is missing out on the amazing uh, combat music. But it is what it is. If we didn't skip all the combat, this this would be a thousand hours long. Ooh, terrible fight. That really hurt. Ah, dude. I'll tell you what we're going to do. Um, let's... These are water enemies, aren't they? Yeah, I was going to say. I wouldn't have thought we could really use too much here against these guys. Attack, power, and defense. It's a shame. Yeah, that's what we want. The entire party, but take 16. Uh, let's cast that on everybody. Right, you. Give me some Alpha Storm. See what you can do. Let's get everyone buffed. Probably should have healed... Enrique, yeah, so that doesn't do much at all. Whoa, danger close. Okay. Note to self, these guys don't mess around. They really don't mess around. You know what? Let's just go for some Cutlass Fury on him, and you can fight as normal. You get some magic. Oh, yeah, we've got no... That's Oh, shit, we don't want a guide. We want to use... Sacred crystals, they're uh, useless. Have you noticed where we went to the item shop before in Euphotoma? They don't even sell those anymore, which is interesting. You would have thought that they would still sell them for one ally. One ally? I mean, I guess we could just throw that to Enrique because he really needs it. I uh, guess we give them some regen health as well. Alright, we need to kill those, because they're the money makers. There we go. Should give him a little bit of health to carry on with. Okay. I guess we could hit everybody with some regen, but... At the same time, we could just attack. Save up some magic. Yeah, these mantles, whatever they're called, these are pretty rough. And that regen in health is really paying off, actually. Now, it regens 250 per turn instead of 200. Which is interesting. Whoa. Whoa, that was a lot of money. Dude, that was insanity. And a Dexter seed. Nice. That was pretty mad. Let's heal everybody up. Because we did take a little bit of a beating there. Even, um, well, Vase has got nearly 4,000 HP. Ica's uh, the closest behind. Fina, that's interesting. Like, Enrique doesn't, isn't, like, that far away. From a health standpoint. Right, let's... We did get that seed, didn't we? Who's got the slowest speed? Uh, we've got the choms. Where's the seed? Ah, there we go. So, increase Agile by one. I don't know who's the slowest. I mean, it only increases it by one, which isn't exactly much. So, his Agile is 11. Uh, wow! Ikers is 22. I didn't expect that. Fina is 12. And Rike is 17. Uh, yeah, so <laughs> I guess Vase is getting that because his agile sucks. Dude, 
What's going on with your agility there? Yeah, that's pretty bad. Anyway, let's keep going. So, decisions, decisions. Oh. Wasn't expecting a dead end. Oh, no, man. Dude. Right. Well, um, there's no point in doing any of your moves yet. Let's just go for... We can go for a magic attack. We can't... Mm. Let's just attack. Um, no point really doing anything with you. Guess attack as well. Now, you can't really do your blessing. Your blessing would be really good. Might do that next turn, actually. Yeah, we'll do Lunar Blessing next turn. Give everyone regen. Why not? Seems like a decent idea, I guess. Wow. Yeah, because these enemies are really high damage output. Or, we could just go for Reign of Swords and see how that gets on. Not sure how. Yeah, that worked. Actually, that worked really well. That'll work. Not perfect, but it will do. We are getting... Whoa, we are getting decent XP. Nice. Getting some blue magic filtering through. Right, so that's a dead end. That's no good. Okay, we can handle these guys. That's fine. No. Definitely want to kill these guys. Because as I said, that's where our money comes from. Might actually be worth... Healing. But I think we're not too bad. Good. He hasn't run away. Which means hopefully... We can get you too. Now, I don't think we need to heal. Nice. That'll work. Wow. Yeah. It's so worth doing that. It is absolutely worth doing that. Alright, let's keep going. Man, there's a lot of fighting here. Ooh. Let's just... Everybody just straight up attack. We'll cast Ingram if we can next turn. Yeah, we should be able to now. Actually, we want you to attack. Attack. Uh, you, you can cast. Wow, she's got so many moves. Kind of crazy. Ah, she doesn't have it. Ooh, that's unfortunate. Well, she does have this. Can cause instant death to all enemies on screen. Well, let's give it a go and see what happens. Nice if it killed some enemies. No. Yeah, that's the only trouble with those moves. Like, when they work, they're really good. But when they don't work, yeah, it's kind of bad. Really bad. So, yeah, I don't really like moves where there's a 50% chance, uh, for instance, of things working. I'd just rather a move either worked or it didn't. Okay, so where are we now? Well, this place looks cool. I guess we're going underwater. Are we going to have to fight underwater? Probably. Now, is there anything slyly hidden away? Like here, for instance. 
I think this is how we get one of our chests. Now, is there underwater combat? Kinda doesn't look like it. I get the feeling if there was, we would have to have engaged in it by now. I was gonna say, wait a minute, how do we get to that damn chest? Oh, right. Go around the outside. Gotcha. Gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, oh, right. Here we go. This is, must be treasure. I know one of them's treasure. Didn't realize it was this one. Bane. Welcome to pain, Bane. Actually. Uh, I, let's get everybody hit up with the regen, shall we? Uh, which one was the regen? Crystals. It's not that one. It's not that one. Healing salve. Yeah, healing salves. Everybody have a healing salve. Start off, might as well. Just give us a little bit of an edge. Not the most exciting first round, but... I like the way it heals us straight away as well, right off the bat. That's pretty cool. Everyone getting their health back. Right. Now I guess we'll go for an attack. Ica. I want you. Ah, uh, you only have Increm as well. Uh, that's unfortunate. Well, I'll tell you what. Use Quicker on everybody. Now. Again, this is kind of unfortunate. Because you can only Increm certain characters. So, Increm Vase to start off with. And I guess... Use a Glyph of Might. I don't know if... Ah, there we go. I was going to say, I don't know if there's a way of uh, organising your inventory a little bit better. I guess there might be. Wow, that hurts. My god, that hurts. So, Fina really needs some healing. Um, go for some Cutlass Fury on you. You. Use a Glyph of Might. I guess on Fina, there's not really a lot of point. Fina, you can use some magic, nope, special move. Uh, each member of regeneration. Yeah, you can't. Uh, try that, why not? And I guess, instead of using your turn for something fun, uh, you use that on Fina. Let's try this. Really? Didn't actually work on him, which is curious. Glyft, glyft yourself. Go glyft yourself. Uh, restores all HP for one ally. Oh, shit. I used the wrong thing. That's probably why. There we go. Looks like we're in a little bit of trouble over there. You use that on Enrique. Uh, actually, yeah, we've got max power, but there's no point. Just go for a standard attack, I guess. You can use Royal, your Royal Blade or whatever it's called. Should finish him off. Probably didn't need to use Royal Blade, but hey. We did it! We did! It. We did. 4,000 gold. Good amount of experience as well. 
what we like to see. And another Dexa seed. And we have the Windsong Orb. Very nice. So if we've got another Dexa seed, Vase can have that because his dexterity is poop. And considering he's like frontline combat, you kind of want him to have a bit of dexterity, surely. But hey, what do I know, I guess. Okay, cool. So one chest down. Which is good. We do like getting our chests. Unfortunately, we do move incredibly slowly underwater, which is unfortunate. But, never mind. We've got these big zips on our um, suit as well, which is really interesting. Just see them flapping around there. I don't know. I don't know. Actually, having a look at this suit, like... I guess we've got some sort of gloves on there. I'm not sure. Kind of a strange design. It's a cool design. I like it. But yeah, it's a little bit weird. Okay. So what do we have this way? We still haven't found our cham yet either. Ooh. Right, before we hit that, let's explore back down this way. And I was thinking then, it's been a long time since we've had glorious combat. But here we go. Glorious combat. Alright, we don't want him to run away. We need his goal. Get his pouch. Get his pouch. Kick him in the dick. Nice. Yeah, that pouch is too too inviting to leave and the XP from those guys ain't bad either oh oh I guess it's just a dead end here okay disappointing well damn it I knew it was only a matter of time before we had another one of these mantoids Damn mantoids, ruining the day. Kill it. Kill him. Oh, put him to sleep. Very nice. Well, a full round of attacks nearly kills it. Which isn't too bad. So another round of attacks should kill it. Wow. That uh, <laughs> put to sleep ability from Ica is really paying for itself. Which I like. Nice. Peace through superior firepower. Okay. Now let's go push our button. And we're almost out of time here. More mantoids. Uh... I guess, actually, if we just go for some of that, see how that works. Should be able to take it out. Oh, so close. Damn, yeah. Silences. That's not good. Ah, dude. Well, at least he's dead. Probably going to have to heal up when we get out of this fight. Yeah. These things are rough. I guess I just could have wiped them out with a magic ability, but... Nah. Hey, nice. I think everybody's kind of catching up now with the old uh, magic attacks. Which is good to see. Let's get the items out. Let's get the crappy crystals out. There we go. Get everybody feeling fine. Yeah, we're going to run out of those, which 
Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Ah, so close and yet so far. I guess we could start using a bit of magic here. Damn you. Damn it. Damn your damn yun. Ooh. Well, taste my lightning, fucker. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. So, what does this one do? You guessed it. Anyway, guys, we're going to have to end it here because apparently we're on 31 minutes. Yeah, I know. So, let's drop a save state or two. I always save over the first four save states because I'm stupid and um, that stops bad things happening. Um, anyway, when we come back, I guess we're going to finish this area. I was hoping to do it in one video, but apparently it's a little bit longer than I remember. Hmm. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and as always, till next time.